Hi, the only French person again. I'll go back to the video. This is another request sent from Bronson, and the name of the video is Jamie Osuna, current country's cold blood killer. This is real. I need Megan for this because this might make me feel uncomfortable, but let's check it out. No. I need you. He's already serving a life sentence for torturing and killing a woman back in 2011. Now, at 31, he's suspected of killing his cellmate. He calls himself sadistic and says he has no plans to stop killing. Why? Why would you? I'm 17 Karen Law, and the case of Jamie Osuna is one okay, my Megan. colleagues have been following be okay. for years. We cover a lot of crime. We've seen many horrific homicides. But Osuna's case is one of the most bone-killing ones we've ever seen, and his image is unforgettable. I've heard of him before. Satanic symbols tattooed across his entire face. Now, Tattoos aren't a terrible thing, it's just Gino, when... Olivia Lavoie sat down with Osuna at Laird Jail. God, he's she creepy. She there for murdering Yvette Tanya in cold blood. She was a mother of six, just gave birth nine Sick months fuck. earlier, and a complete stranger to him. The day after he met her, he pointed out that deserved to be executed. I don't know what the rules are where he is, but people like that to me need to be executed. Found at the El Morocco Hotel with a pair of scissors and a knife in her back. Jeez. Sadistically, premeditatedly, deliberately, tortured. He's seen it so calmly, he doesn't give a shit. And he told us on camera. He murdered the woman simply because he had the opportunity to. It's a rough shit to the picture of the drug. I would rather do that than the drug. I'd rather do that than have sex with the beautiful woman in the world. In his motive, he said killing gives him a rush and a sense of fulfillment. Does he jizz in his pants over? <laughs> I didn't mean to say that, you guys. I'm just really mad that this kind of shit happen happens. Even after he tortured Tanya, he continued to torture her loved ones in court, laughing, making faces at This guy's a piece of shit. He needs to die. He chatted about the Oakland Raiders when he signed his life away. Yeah, there's a fate worse than death, actually. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. It's not often, even as somebody who prosecutes murderers for a living, that I come across a people just plain evil. Um, if anybody deserves the death penalty, Jamie Osuna does. Exactly. So why didn't you kill him? And it doesn't end with Pena's murder. Osuna admitted to us, even bragged about being responsible for two other unsolved murders. Did you know the other two victims? No. How old were you? Twenty-two. 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 Twenty-two.
Osuna is serving a life sentence, and he's just admitted to killing his cellmate, Luis Romero, at Corcoran State Prison. According to new documents we've obtained, Romero was decapitated. His lungs, eyeballs, ears, No, I need you, Megan. His whole body... That's, this is scaring me, people. And Osuna admitted to all of it, but pled not guilty. He could now face the death penalty. If I could go back and change it all over again and over again, and if I'm released, I'll probably come back here with the same thing. This is fucked up. <clears throat> Mostly, why would a man who bragged about killing be assigned a cellmate? Where did he obtain his weapon? And mostly, why would he be left unsupervised? This guy is just a piece of trash. Deserves to be executed. Deserves to fucking die. That's all I got for y'all. I'm gonna get off here because my friend is trying to call me. So yeah. With that said, thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Peace out. Me and Megan. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry it was just a dark one, but I hope Megan's cuteness made, made you feel less scared. So, yeah. But, with that said, thank you guys. Peace out, guys. Bye bye.